Okay guys, I'm really quickly just fighting the rain that's just about to come in, as it said it would. Now, hopefully you can see okay here, FX Dreamline, I've just put the new rail on the top of it. So, it's much better because this rail has got 20 MOA in it. And before, the crosshairs of the scope were just below the bottom half of the screen, if you know what I mean. That always bugged me. I've just changed that, just done my re-zero shot. And now it looks to me like it's much, much better near the centre of the screen. Let's have a look. Ooh, a little bit left. bit left I might have to just tweak the zero that tiny bit but that would be fine yeah look at that but now as you can see I'm much happier with that cloth hair this everything fits in there really nice now because the magazine just sits under it I got that full rail of Picatinny my eye relief is just that little bit better as well on it as before it was so yeah that works so much better than trying to work uh, over this magazine or where I had to put this sort of right back here and so on so yeah and I'm much much happier with the centralization of that uh, crosshair so I'll just tweak that because before I was aim at the bottom of this log there's a little dark spot there and that's where it was hitting. That's how much it, it's brought it up with that 20 MOA rail at 30 meters. So I was shooting there and it pulled it right up there. I re-zeroed it to where I am and now that's much better. It's like centrally right nicely in the screen. Okay, let's just tweak that little zero from that dot just out to the outer circle and we should be good to go. Okay guys, I've just tweaked my zero again from that one. So I was aiming at the centre and we were hitting just on the outer circle. So let's see where we go now. Let's try that one. Ooh. And still a tiny bit to the right. Let's uh, try another one out of the way. Yep, so I need to tweak it a little bit more to the right. Should I do that while you're on? I can't record it, it won't allow me to record it. So on the Wolf 4K, just press the button. The correction menu is already in front of me because that's what I used last. Press the button, I get a red cross come up. And uh, you tweak this. This is in the Y axis, I think. No, the X axis according to that. Let's go there. I don't need to do the elevation at all. So I'm going to back out of it. It says uh, to save it on P1. I've got four options of zero in to save. I'm gonna save on that. It says saved successfully. It's come out of the menu. Hit the record button again. Now we're recording again. Let's zoom in and let's uh, see if it's adjusted that tiny bit. Let's go and run more to the outside of the circle so let's try that one oh you might be on now are you liking that guys now 
pulled that one, sorry I didn't mean to pull the trigger quite at that point. It's loving the GSB Hades this rifle. Let's keep going. Breeze will come up. Yeah, just a tiny bit of breeze. Pulled that one, sorry guys. In fact, it felt like it loaded a bit different and this one just ended. Let's hit that same one now. Yeah. Okay, that's it. Anyway, there we go. Right. So that's the FX Dreamline with the uh, tactical rail on the top now. Um, and that's made a good difference. I'm well happy with that now. Crosshair is nice in the centre of the scope. I can get my eye relief really nice i can look straight in and see all the edges of the screen and everything there yeah that's uh that's working out well i think it's bang in the center now those those crosshairs okay another gun i need to get out and get some uh footage for you guys okay cheers guys right just load up with five more let's hit these five from the r10 that's five GSB Diablos, 16 grains, or well 50.89 from the R10 like shot a bit earlier, that hole there. And these are the Hades, that one went a little bit low left. Hades hit really heavy and they're shooting just over 900 feet per second. Uh, I'm enjoying that. The eye relief's much better on the scope. The, uh, the crosshair is now bang in the centre, yeah? Yeah, like that. Okay. Thanks, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you found this little thing interesting more for me than anything so uh, let's get the rifle back on the squirrel soon.